Allied Cinema. One example of the films made by America during World War II was the Why We Fight series of films, most of which were directed by Frank Capra. There were seven films in total, starting with Prelude to War in 1942 and ending with War Comes to America in 1945. Each film was shot like a documentary or newsreel and was around one hour long. The purpose of these films was to show how dangerous the enemy was and how even those living in America, which was far away from the war in Europe, needed to fight against the Axis forces. American cartoons also made fun of the enemy. Warner Brothers made films like Hair Meets Hair, a film starring Bugs Bunny, who tricks Germans and even Hitler himself. They also made Daffy the Commando, which saw Daffy Duck attack a German base and hit Hitler on the head with a big wooden hammer. Another propaganda cartoon was made by Paramount Pictures. It was called You're a Sap, Mr. Jap. In the film, the character Popeye fights against the Japanese Navy. The Japanese boats were shown as old, broken and weak. The Japanese characters were strange, cowardly and stupid. All of these cartoons had one purpose, to make the enemy look silly and therefore much less scary. Axis Cinema The Axis forces used cinema even before the war began to start getting support for their beliefs. Five years before the war had even started, a film called Triumph of Will was celebrating Nazi politicians. The film was a collection of speeches by Hermann, Goering and Hitler. The speeches were edited together with shots of huge crowds cheering and clapping. The aim of this film was to show these opinions were popular and effective. The woman who made the film, Lena Reifenstahl, made films throughout the war and was well respected by Hitler himself. Later in life, she denied having made propaganda films, even though her work was well loved by the Nazi party. Germany made many types of films during this time such as documentaries, dramas, and even comedies. Perhaps the most common type of film was called the home front movie, which would focus on members of the public and how the war was affecting them. An example of a home front movie is the Dagenhearts. It shows a family of a father, mother and five children living in a city called Lübeck, which was bombed by the British Air Force in 1942. This film had two purposes. First, it made the British look like the bad guys for bombing a family. And secondly, it prepared the public for the trouble they may face in the future and how they could overcome it.